Hi guys, I just want you to know that now you can join my channel uh, on your PC or your phone. Uh, you would click the join button and you can scroll and you can join for $9.99 each month and get early access to all videos. And you can also um, get one question answered by me every month. Um, and you'll get access to all the extendeds. There is also another tier uh, for $14.99, uh, you will get two questions answered every month and access to uh, all the extended readings and early access to just all videos. So take advantage now. Uh, it's here for you. Thank you. Take care. Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking sharing commenting and subscribing to the channel it means a lot please continue to do so all links are below if you need to get in contact with me let's go ahead and get into it thank you god for blessing aquarius with a clear concise message from you all right let's see how you're coming into the week aquarius how is aquarius coming into the week okay the magician very nice uh you've got good ideas you're trying to bring something into fruition you get the idea so so you know uh what is it um completely forgot having a brain fart um so above or you know you know what i'm saying you know it you know, come at me because i forgot anyway um as as but as above so below there we are something like that anyhow <laughs> Aquarius, this just talks about you having ideas and you're just really trying to make it happen, make something shake. Like you're really trying to make it real. It's just like, okay, I've got all these ideas. What do I need to do first? Um, you have everything that you need, you know, like you have the intellect, you have the money. If not all money, you can get started on something. So it's just about maybe ideas. You're getting some really bright flashes of inspiration. Some of you are channeling from the universe too. You know, maybe you are meditating, channeling, get just downloads all together. So you're really in a very masculine uh, energy right now because you're doing a lot of thinking, a lot of thought process going on for you right now. You're trying to bring something into institution. Uh, you could be dealing with a very powerful man or you are that man. Um, you could be dealing with speech also. I don't know the, how you're trying to put together something, how you're trying to, um, relay. Um, you, you could be a good orator. You could be a salesperson. Um, you're trying to sell something. You, you, tr this could also be planning. Maybe you're trying to put together a business plan or plans for this looks good. This is how you're coming into the week. This is also uh, magic, you know, be you being the magician, you making the magic happen. You could be actually doing, you know, magical work, whatever that is. Let's see. Um, what is the advice for Aquarius this week? Get the Queen of Swords. So get real firm and true about what needs to leave your life. What is not bringing value? The Queen of Swords. So this could be looking over your finances. Oh, I'm spending too much here. I need to trim the fat there. This could be, oh, this person is a drag. They're holding me back. They're holding me down. I need to really start to sever ties. It could be anything, but this is the executive. So she or he is making the final uh, decision here in terms of a, a relationship, in terms of anything, definitely planning or pre-planning. Let's see what the outcome is if you take the advice of the Queen of Swords. Also, it talks about getting mentorship um, before cutting something out or cutting something off. Get some type of counsel it could even talk about spiritual counsel some of you could have left a relationship and this relationship prompted you and brought you to spirituality because it jogged your 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 mental it's like why am i stuck here why am i having a hard time or this is what you need to be doing this is what you need to be doing so that you can move forward and that could even piggyback off of going to get counseling mentorship as to why you're stuck here or why you're stuck on that particular thing the queen of swords sometimes can come up as jaded hurt still not forgiving either and most times it could even be not forgiving yourself and that's the biggest hurdle because we can forgive other people and you know keep them over there and we're done but at the same time it's hard to forgive yourself 
uh, for being so stupid is what I heard. Some of you could be calling yourself that. Uh, do know that falling in love and liking someone and really wanting to show up genuine is not stupid. Uh, you just have to really kind of question why you continue to give when, you know, it wasn't reciprocated or you were hurt or were you giving from a place of uh, love or was it from a place of desperation, you know? So it's just like the Queen of Swords, she comes in and it's like, we're about to evaluate this whole thing and make it real and make it plain for you so that you can cut this off and have newness in your life. She's also about, you know, the sword of truth severing so that new can uh, reside there. Let's see what the outcome is if you take the advice of the cards. Seven of Pentacles, so learning lesson here, maturity also. Um, floodgates is what I'm hearing, opening for you. A uh, harvest is here. For some of you, this is going to be a pause, a break. No activity between you and a particular person or just between you and relationships, romantic relationships or friendships. You need a pause. You need a break so that you can mature. You can learn something, learn lesson. Seven of Pentacles, uh, Mercury, Saturn. Um, so this is about definitely hard life lessons. This is restriction too, you know, so it's like uh, putting a restriction on a relationship, maybe in business, maybe even restricting your money because we, we're going to go back to that. Some of you need to trim the fat. You're spending here. You're doing this. You're buying that. You want to go here. You might need to put some restrictions on your spending here. Uh, let's go ahead and clarify this reading. What? Can we say, lastly, for Aquarius, you have the page of pentacles. Good news about money matters. Starting something new, healthy. This could be in money. This could be in just your physical health, healthy choices and relationships. Also, the page of pentacles comes in and talks about consistency. It talks about uh, being studious. So maybe even learning something, learning to be consistent, be a consistent saver. Uh, the page of pentacles talks about health. So is your financial health where it needs to be. You may have money, but money comes in and it goes out just as quickly as you make it. So this is really um, about, you know, health and relationships. This is about um, also you, maybe you have options in love or options will come for you in love. Make the right and the healthy choice. Um, only deal with people who are consistent uh, and whatever it is you value, you know, consistently communicating with you, consistently showing up. I don't know. So just um, you have to really evaluate. We have evaluation and then we have page of pentacles, healthy evaluation. It looks like it's going to be opportunity for you to uh, do something really big. Uh, Aquarius, uh, the universe is going to open some door. It's, you got to take it right then and there. It's not going to be like, okay, well, whenever you're ready, Aquarius. No, it's going to be like here now go. I know it. you have a yes answer and you have the best yes in this deck because it has the exclamation point. So it's a definite yes here. Yes, yes, yes. All right. And we do. Okay. That's what I'm saying. Com communicate clearly. And we talked about that. Uh, and we talked about your communication oration skills. I don't know. Maybe you are uh, going to communicate. Uh, cl cl I heard communicate clearly to the universe what it is you want. Some of you being very vague, very general. You have to be as uh, specific as possible what is the yes card what is this yes card for the Aquarius what is the yes card for Aquarius two of pentacles yes okay so you could be doing two different things for money you could be earning income by doing two different things money is coming in you're keeping everything up it is a balance and act it is a juggle other people may feel like oh that's stressful but you have a hang on it you know your life has come into this rhythm here um, you could be doing two things at the same time, learning one thing while still working or working, going to school, whatever it is you're doing. Um, it says that, you know, the work that you're doing in the two of pentacles will be perfected in the four of pentacles. If you see the four of pentacles, if you see status change, if you see large sum of money, if you see newfound wealth. So just keep up whatever it is you're doing. Yes, you're on the right path. Um, Yes, somebody has changed or they're showing you that they're changing. Okay. It's a lot going on around you and someone else. I'm going to get one more card. What is this? Two of Pentacles. King of Cups. All right. So this could have to do with, you know, someone else, an external uh, person. Um, it's like they're trying to decide something or they're trying to weigh up or they're trying to do something. There's a lot going on behind your back or that you don't see. Um, this person does have a lot of love for you, uh, for the relationship. 
or they're still looking at you. They also have something else that they're dealing with that they're trying to deal with. Um, yeah, it's just like, um, so this is a relationship that never really got off the ground. It was still in the 3D, you know, with the magician and the high priestess here. It's just more so, I don't know, somebody's trying to make something real or they're trying to have opportunity to come towards you. Yeah, this is like a soulmate, twin flame, whatever you subscribe to. I don't know if somebody's trying to show you that they've changed. They want the relationship back. All of a sudden, they can't stop thinking about you, fantasizing about you. You know, um, you guys are not on the same page right now. You're about vibrations and having good vibes. And this person is about maybe holding their um, their emotions in. Uh, they're still stuck. They want forgiveness from you. They want to salvage a relationship, even if they have to be your quote unquote friend. Um, yeah, they want to start something up. I don't know if they want you as an option. This, for some of you, this is just a person who doesn't know how to let go, doesn't know how to not have access to you. For They had access to you for a very long time, and now you shut it off or you shut it out, and they just don't know how to deal with not being able to come to you, talk to you, be with you, whatever it is you guys used to do. They don't like this newfound way of existing, okay? And it's because some of you... Uh, you're learning, you're maturing in, in, in love and relationship and you're learning how to make healthier choices and not deal with people who seem as if they have changed. Um, so the cards could be, yes, this person is put it on an act because the two of pentacles could sometimes talk about the court jester, you know, somebody who is, you know, juggling They're they're acting, they're trying to make you see, look over here, you know, <laughs> Um, this person is good at that. They're good at um, balancing out their emotions also, showing you what they want to show you. So the cards are telling you that this is a relationship that may never get off the ground in this lifetime, though you may be soulmate, twin flame, whatever. Um, somebody's just not ready. And you need to learn that. And you got in the universe put restriction, uh, you know, in the midst of this relationship between you and said individual because, um, yeah, you, something needs to be illuminated with the sun card also the universe is shining bright on you for you to start something uh, for you to uh, buckle down also uh, hunker down some of you have investments you're waiting for money money is coming um you will get uh reap the reward of your investments here a return on your energy return on your money here um it says finish what you start also it says look over be prudent with your money if you started something continue it don't give up it's just the beginning it didn't pop and you, it wasn't major, but you might have to put the work in the eight of pentacles to make it major. Okay. So keep at it. You only got one or two people following you, subscribe to you, come into your live. Just keep going because you'll show the universe that, that you really want this. Okay. And let that be your prayer. All right. Last card for Aquarius. What they can they expect in the near future? a false person that's what i'm saying and it lays right here on this person who wants to tell you that they've changed but they really have not they're showing up you know in that falsehood they want to show you something that you will be receptive to but behind that is the same old same old they have not changed you cannot yeah it's going to be hard work laborious with this person toil and labor you know it, this is a hard relationship it's hard to be with them um they just same old energy this person is just not in it they can't they can't get over the fact that they can't have sex with you be with you see you you're not talking to them they're expecting your call your text message they're thinking about you in the relationship they're thinking about have you found someone new you're going to have great fortune with someone else aquarius just keep going and rest in the energy of redefining yourself uh, firstly, and then everything will be added to you. If this resonates for you, Aquarius, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the bio, a coffee link, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. Get your bracelets, especially if you're going through healing or you just need protection. Get your, um, your tourmaline bracelets and your amethyst bracelets okay the link will be below uh, come learn the tarot with me you can book classes there you can book them all or you can book them one at a time uh what else can what's going on oh join the membership here on youtube where you can get uh access to 
all of the readings uh, exclusively first. You'll get access first. And then you can also ask one question a month, one personal question answered by me. Uh, and then also I have another tier where you can get two questions answered a month. So take advantage of that. You'll see that join button there. Um, if you're feeling moved to do so, please do so. Thank you guys. Take care. Many blessings. Thank you.